Okay. Yep, yep. We are live again. And uh, today we are continuing with the uh, Minecraft the story mode. And uh, I'm still here. Yeah, <laughs> Casper's still here. So we're going to play. So how do we look? We're definitely going the girl route. <laughs> ah, we are going white. White girl. Yeah. Start episode one. Okay. Nothing built can last forever, and every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost, until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures, unabridged as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes, and ours was fortunate to have, so long ago, four heroes such as these. Gabriel, the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard, the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the Rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. Ooh. And Zoran, the architect, builder of worlds, and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. But when one story ends, another one begins. Woohoo! <laughs> Boy, Would you rather fight a hundred chicken sized zombies or ten zombie sized chickens? Just to be uh, clear, you wouldn't have any weapons or armor. So zombie sized chickens or chicken sized zombies? That's easy. Uh, I'll take these zombies. little tiny little zombies. A hundred of them. Crawling all over you with their tiny hands. Uh, all I need is like a shovel. Uh, I'm telling you, way too easy. So, I've got a daylight sensor <laughs> on the roof. <laughs> and if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us? Really? <laughs> Oh. What kind of question is that? Picky. Of course he is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like... Uh, it's not weird at all. No. It's not weird at all. Reuben is the best pet I could ask for. Obedient, loyal, and always happy to see me at the end of a long day. Friend. I should have said friend, not pet. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. Well, I'm getting tired of it. Just embrace I'm tired it. Of being a stock. <laughs> embrace being a loser, Olivia. And if you do that, you can be whatever you want to be. What if I want to be a winner? Except that. <laughs> Anything else, though. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Fun. Do you hear that? Ah, it's a creeper. No. Boom! That's some very nice hair you have there. Oh, man. You guys totally freaked out. That was awesome. Axel, what's the matter with you? <clears throat> Great. Now I'm gonna smell like a pig in Endercon. Cool mask. I thought we were buddies. Cool mask. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Very convincing. 
<laughs> the look on your faces. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he looks. As long as Reuben is happy, I'm happy. Happy? <laughs> well, zippity doo dah. Okay, relax. It's fine. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. Waiting on you guys. Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? All okay. right. We just shears. Definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. No. Yeah, you're right. One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition, and when we do, people will look at us and say, "Hey." There goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. Okay. I got the stand as a gift, but I don't have any armor to put on it. Maybe someday. Oh. Give me a dragon war, Ruben. <laughs> Meow. That'll do, Ruben. That'll do. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> I'll see ya. Gabriel the warrior. the warrior. You think we'll ever get that famous? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection. Hmm. I just... Uh, flint and steel, not too shabby. You wanna burn something? <laughs> I can't burn anything. That's cheating. I want to burn this house down. Come on, let me. Nope. Okay, we come down. <laughs> That's everything. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building competition, but you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. Also, it's in two parts, each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one, the special guest at this year's Entercon is none other than Gabriel the warrior him freaking self. Whoa, what's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition is gonna get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose. But if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the love to meet Gabriel. Meeting Gabriel would be a dream and an honor. Totally, he's awesome. It'd be amazing to meet him. Reuben better be careful in that costume. The last time Gabriel saw a dragon, it didn't end well. <laughs> so, does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? <laughs> Yeah, so loud. my uh, source uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. <laughs> we have a competition to win. We never win. And this year we've got Ruben with us. We basically have no chance. Uh, anything can happen. We win this time. We're going to win. Because... What are you talking about? Because up to now, we've hated losing. What a piss but today. Today, my friends, exactly. we're going to start learning how to love winning. That didn't sound as good as it did in my head. No, <laughs> no, I'm with that. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. You have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay, then. So how do Is we do news? this? We don't just build something <laughs> functional. We're building we're a naked pig. <laughs> After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. You might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their moments. Both pretty scary. Then again, you scared the crap out of us with a creeper. What about Let's something? build a zombie. I guess that's kind of like a creeper. Eh, it's a monster. It's fine. <laughs> so ready. Yeah. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? 
It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. Bring the pixels in. Dare to prepare on three. Nope. Preparing is daring. Nope. That's the same thing. Forget it. Team on three. One, two, three. Team. Team. Prepare. Prepare. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> what the hell are we doing here? Oh my god, that is fast! Speed hack. Eight. Two. I'm bad at QGs. <laughs> Shearing sheaves! <laughs> stuff for it we are so ready this year it's going to be different i'm not just ready to build i'm ready to win nice pig losers oh mm. oh great there's lucas and the ocelots oh, the, cool the rivalry guys. continues oh the one man <laughs> matching leather jackets and everything so cool <laughs> Well, well, I'm well. Say that. If it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> Great. The fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. Name, please? Axel. And, uh, how do you do? No, your team name. Team name? We are not ready for this. <laughs> uh... So much for losing anonymous. In the order of the pig. <laughs> the order of the pig. <laughs> really? Is that to tie us to Reuben, or are you making fun of me? Okay, order of the pig. You guys are in booth five. The order of the pig. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, you bad. Yeah. <laughs> oh God. This is a square too big. <laughs> New chest. More chest. Nope. No. Aww. Mm-hmm. Where's the mouse? Two, five. I guess we're going to booth five. Is that a freaking beacon? They have a freaking beacon? Freaking beacon? That's stained glass. They aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. We're gonna lose. Yeah, don't worry, we got what this. Are you worried about? We've got this. Who are we kidding? We've got nothing. We've got. A mascot. Why? <laughs> <laughs> we should probably stop staring at them. Ha ha ha. Look, it's the Order of the Losers again. <laughs> we should have chosen that name. Yeah. <laughs> We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to look at it after it wins and gets shown at Endercon. You're being unpleasant. Maybe not all of you. You're being unpleasant. Endercon doesn't allow outside food or drink. <laughs> I'm talking about your pig. It's not food. I'm saying he's food. Uh, you really shouldn't mess with Reuben. I do what I want. Besides, what arm can a pig do? Keep talking and find out. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got work to do. You're lucky I'm busy. 